this is the watch dog welcome back to fun with watches if watches were fun you'd only need one today we have an unboxing for you just uh, one watch today i have a watch from aliexpress so let's get started so let's start with the wrist check i'm wearing this chensky 8856 i just reviewed this watch so if you haven't seen the review you should be sure to check it out and greg was wearing my north edge anchor Gergo said he's watching Game of Groans on HBO, and John Sam the Pike's turd was just elected the Lord Commander of the Jedi Knight's Watch. I said, why are you calling him a Pike's turd? He said, there are no bass on Tatooine. All right, let's get this watch open. Just one watch today. I didn't have a lot of watches on order, so I didn't want to wait for more than one watch. Plus, I figured this one's a pretty good one, so I'll... Go ahead and unbox it anyway. Don't have to wait for another one. I was kind of looking forward to this one. And we have a Cadison. Cadison's always come in this box. I've never seen one that came in a different box. And this is an unboxing video. We have the warranty card. And I'm assuming this stamp here means it's signed. I don't know though. But it probably doesn't matter. Here are the instructions. And here's the sign cleaning cloth. Or polishing cloth. And any tools. Yes, we have a small screwdriver. Well, that means we have screw pins. And not push pins. And here is the watch. We have a Cadison Cookie Monster. So I've reviewed quite a few Cadisons on this channel, but I realized the other day that I never reviewed a sub homage from Cadison. So I better rectify that. So I ran ahead and ordered one because I've done so many other sub homages that it just seemed a shame that I haven't done Cadison yet. Because Cadison makes some pretty good watches. They're in the same league as Pagani Design. And in some ways, they're a little bit nicer, I would say, on some watches, but some watches, I don't know. But we'll see what their subs like. Let's get this plastic open. And look at this on the fly adjustment. You don't get that with the Pagani Design sub homage or homage. I've been trying to say homage lately instead of homage. Just sounds, I guess it sounds more pretentious. So maybe that's a bad thing. I don't know. But homage sounds more like it's trying to uh, give tribute, where homage means it's kind of respecting. I don't know. So, I guess you can leave comments. You want me to say homage or you want me to say homage? Because I can go back to saying homage. I don't, don't mean anything to me. But, getting this off. Alright. Got most of the plastic off. So, let's get the blue off. like the clasp is signed and it looks like the blue is leaving a lot of residue though though so okay the plastic is off we got the blue on the crown but I'll remove that later with some packing tape let's go ahead and spin the bezel okay the bezel action is good no back clay. Nice solid clicks. And it looks like it lines up. And then we have a Cyclops that does a decent amount of magnification. I always say if you're going to have a Cyclops, then have a Cyclops. And there's nothing worse than a Cyclops that hardly magnifies. But this one really magnifies. And we do not have a display case back. Oh, we got some plastic here. Let's get this off. And it looks like we have a screw down case back. So 
So let's go ahead and put it on the wrist and see what it looks like. Here's the watch in size of my seven and a half inch wrist. That looks nice. That wears nice. And it looks like I can get almost four fingers. So I don't know, close enough. I'll give this to Joe Haynes seal of approval. And okay. Well, thank you for watching my unboxing video and I will be back with another review. Be sure to like and subscribe to my channel. And if you like this watch, be sure to use my affiliate link and I'll get a tiny commission. Bye.